Guys, today we're going to talk about cheap projectors. Now, we've all seen these projectors on Amazon, eBay, and so forth, and you're really skeptical about buying a projector because you know if you get it home, the lumens are going to be really, really horrible, and that is going to wreak havoc on the picture quality and so forth. So, this is a projector I bought way back, um, probably about a year or a half ago, and um, this projector is a, well, first of all, let me explain who I am. You guys know me as Kenneth Bird as a creator of Crystal Witch Technology Screens. I'm not going to go any farther than that, but just just talk about this projector right here. So you can get these projectors on Amazon and eBay for around fifty, sixty, or eighty dollars. Now, this projector says it's a thousand lumens. I'm thinking about maybe a hundred to hundred and fifty lumens because this is my two hundred lumen Brookstone projector right here, my mini Brookstone projector, and it's at two hundred lumens and it's bright as I don't know what. It's a very good projector. Now, the problem is when you have these cheap projectors. This one's really bad. I don't ever buy this projector. This projector's forty-eight lumens. Let's leave that one alone. So the problem you have with projectors is that the lumens uh, hitting the screen, it comes back, the picture comes back quality, but it comes back looking bad because the screen is not bright enough. The gain on the screen is not bright enough. Well, we have a screen still working on it, still under testing, which is called Future Tech uh, 47AG, which is literally so bright that it, the screen is silver. It's actually brighter than the color white. It can produce an image that's brighter than white. So I'm going to show you what we got over here on the wall. Right, so we have the cheap projector, as you can see right here is our cheap projector. All right, and then over here on the wall, sorry about the Future Tech 4K, the sample sheet's a little beat up, doing a lot of testing on it. We have the Polar Star by Elite Screens. We have the uh, Dark Star 9. Mind you, has a gain of 0 0.9. All right, and the uh, Polar Star has a gain of 1.2. All right, and then we have a white screen, which is the Studio Tech 130, and just a white sheet of paper or your white wall, whatever you're going to be shining this on. So I'm going to show you this really quick. We're going to do this on a snow scene. Now watch this. The AG47 screen. I think my screen's loading. Hold on, come Let me go check over here real quick. Let's see what's going on. Yeah, we're loading. Ooh, not good for the demonstration, is it? Let me come out here and see if we're having any any issues. Okay. We'll go ahead and just reset all this. Little technical difficulties. These things pop up, they happen. Alright, so we'll get this out of here, out of here. Pause that for a minute. Alright, so let's come over to the screen again. And as you can see, this is the uh, 47... Uh, it's a Future Tech 47 AG screen. As you can see, none of the screens are picking it up. You see, the white wall is barely picking up the scenery. Over here, we have the Polar Star by Elite Screens. We have over here the um, Studio Tech 130 white sheet of paper. And then over here, we have the Elite Screen. And then over here, we have the um, um, Future Tech. Uh, 47 AG and look at it now sorry about the blots just blots you're seeing right here on the screen that comes from me um, beating the crap out of the sample sheet didn't do a really good job of storing it um, actually I had this technology last year I just decided to just start sharing it this year but I've had it for a while so that sample sheet has been sitting down in my area for quite some time but yep this shows you right here that the screen is literally brighter than uh, the surrounding um, screens around it. Now watch this. I mean, this screen pretty much can produce a, actually can actually boost your lumen count on your projector. I mean, make it brighter. If any of your projector has a very low lumen count, you hit it with this screen, the screen is going to boost it. And we're talking about with 0% hot spotting and 0% screen glare. Now, you're going to take the white sheet of paper. We're going to put it against the screen right there. Now watch this, it's going to turn the white sheet of paper gray. Now you would think the white sheet of paper would be brighter than the silver screen. But it's actually darker. And it will do the exact same thing to anything that lands against it. So take the white sheet of paper off, right here, put it down here, and we'll grab the Older star, put it in the center of the screen, come back over here, 
Look at that. It makes no difference. Now let's get something with a little color in it. So we're going to come out of here real quick and grab another demonstration. Let's get that off my screen. First, that's got to go. All right. So let's grab a color demonstration, some color in it. Depending if my Comcast decides that it wants to work with me today. Let's see if we can grab this one. We've done this already, but we're going to do it again. There you go. We're using a very cheap uh, projector, an unnamed brand knockoff projector. And as you can see, it's producing a better image on this wall. Look at this. Now, watch this. I'm going to remove that. I'm going to take this screen, put it over here, all right, I'm going to take the white piece of paper, put it right there, I'm going to come back here, literally brighter than a white sheet of paper. Look at all the other screens around it. This is on a cheap knockoff projector. So this screen has the capability of boosting your projector's lumens to give you a brighter picture. And it can do it with 0% hotspot and 0% glare. Look at this. There's the same image showing up on this screen, showing up on that screen, showing up on that screen. But look how it's coming up on this projector that is probably around 100 to 150 lumens. And I got like paid or probably about $50 for this projector. And we're doing this in a fully lit environment, plenty of light. Now watch this, we'll take the lights out. I don't know what, how much it's gonna do because it's already daylight outside. Look at the picture quality, the lights out compared to everything around it. And we're doing this on a very a projector I paid about 50, about 50 to 60 bucks for. And look at that. At a, probably about 100 to 150 lumens. Cheap knockoff projector. The screens are literally that bright that they can actually boost your projector's cap at a lumen capability. All right, so uh, that's in the mind. It's a white sheet of paper in the middle of that screen. All right, so we're going to remove this, take the white sheet of paper, put it down here. We are going to grab the Studio Tech 130, which is a more superior screen than a white sheet of paper. Put that right there in the center. Come back. Watch this. Cheap $50. The $60 projector. That's how amazing these screens are. They can boost your projector's lumen capability. Look at that. And even with the lights on. And usually if you get a projector this cheap, and I'm talking about really cheap, hold on for a minute. I'm gonna set the projector right here for a minute. Kind of forgot to do something here. I was supposed to have a measuring tape out here, but I mean, judging from where the projector's sitting, we're probably about nine feet from the screen. So we'll step back here a minute. All right, so you can see where the projector's at right here and right there. And you can see the screen. So about nine feet. I thought I had my measuring tape down there, but I didn't. So we'll do another one. I'll do another one um, probably, uh, I'm gonna rest for now, I've been up working constantly. But I'm gonna do another one probably later on tonight with the measuring tape, because I forgot to put it down. I really apologize for that. But you can see where the projector is sitting, from where it's right here, from right there. And we're talking about using somewhere between in the range of maybe 100 to 150 lumens. You know, basically when it comes to these, uh, 
uh, cheap knockoff projectors, they over embellish the specifications on the on the projector's capability. You know, my Brookstone is 200 lumens and it's way brighter than this, so I say it's somewhere around maybe 100 to 150 lumens on this projector. And as you can see, even in a fully lit room at around eight feet back, the screen looks incredible. Now watch this, I'm gonna cover this up real quick, right there. All right, so you've seen that with the Studio Tech 130, right there on the screen. And you can see the screen was able to produce a better picture than the Studio Tech 130. We'll take the Dark Star 9, for those of you who own that screen. And then we'll get right back over here again. Same demonstration, got the Dark Star 9 in the middle. And look at this. Now we'll, we'll turn the lights out. For those of you who own the Dark Star 9, I'll show you what we're getting from a cheap projector. This is how amazing these screens are. I got people already asking, I've got maybe 20 to 30 emails of people asking me, where can they get the screen from? Okay, so here's the thing with these screens. Um, the future tech screens are in a bit of negotiation with some uh, big projection screen companies. Um, so we don't know exactly what's gonna happen, but we do know that basically the screen is still under testing. So for right now, we need to concentrate on that. Now watch this, I'll cover this up. I'm gonna come over here to my window. Now it's not sunny outside, but I can let some light in here. More light in here, guys. Come over here next to the screen. Watch this. And we're talking about with the window, light coming in, you see lights coming in the window at anywhere between 100 to 150 lumens on this projector. All right. So let's hit the lights. Still brighter. See, this is what that's why the screens are called Future Tech. Because they have an amazing capability to do some outstanding things. Look at this. And around that entire screen as the only image that's punching up that screen. Okay guys, hope you enjoyed this video demonstration. I'm Kenneth Burr from Crystal Wish Technology Projection Screens. Thank you for watching our new Future Tech 4K. This is the 47HE, still under testing. Thank